G'day guys, what's cracking? It's your boy Two Aussie here again and I'm here with the lovely Liz. We finally made it to Chicken Treat. We're heading into Chicken Treat. There's a new join in town, bit of competition for KFC and Red Rooster. Now apparently these guys are a big deal in WA and they've got a couple of stores now. We're at Eastern Creek. There's another one at Crow's Nest just opened up not so long ago. And we're going in to see if they're worth giving a crack. Let's get in there. Let's go. And we're back babies and we got the goods good old chicken treat now i went with a palmy box which has a uh, beverageino in it 390 mils i think this was 18.99 but i'll circle back to you about that we only got the one drink because liz and i will share it won't we mm -hmm. now you got something we don't see very often it actually does look like a large chips haha <laughs> uh -huh, that's what it's saying too yep there you go my love i may have snuck one or two out she had a few on the way, couldn't wait. And some onion rings. Did you eat any of them yet? No. I didn't see you. Drool. Oh, drool. Haven't tried an onion ring. And here it is. The old palmy box. Anything else in there? Oh, there's an escapee. I better get it. Now, have you heard this thing about these are supposed to be WA's finest chips? Well, I did go when I was in Perth. But I didn't try the... Do you want salt? plain chips i only <laughs> tried sweet potato and yes i always want salt gotta have a chip gotta salt up these onion rings did you ask them for extra salt i did oh that's why they're in there. there's a few in there of course there. i did if you need them plenty in there i can't live without salt crunch now this is supposed to have like kfc and red rooster like a box meal with the old potato and gravy where's my chips i thought it's supposed to have chips with it that was the extra chips probably that you gave uh, them back. I didn't give it back. They, well, they took it back. They took it back. Bloody hell, you can't trust these people. Oh, they had them in the bag and then they said they were for someone else. I'll be back. You can take, you can start the show. <laughs> we should go back. Well, I got a little bit smart because I wanted to look for in the future. I got this thing so we can actually check. And I'm pretty sure because it, it is a box meal, it should have them. These are nice. Now, palmy box. Now there was two versions of this box. One was with a chicken leg piece or a chicken piece bone, it's a bone in, in the chicken. And the other one was boneless. I forget what they call it, crunchified or some malarkey. I'm trying on you. Not right now, thank you. I'm doing thorough investigations here. Um, palmy box, regular. Yep, it. there it is on the picture. Yeah, we'll go back. Look. Chips. I'm not going to be ripped off with chips. There it is, folks. Palmy box with the chips. They literally put them in the bag, and the other one came along and said, No, they're for someone else. So they got it wrong. They didn't know what they were doing. Could hardly understand a thing they were saying. And I got someone hassling me to come down to this bloody place. Well, so far it hasn't been a great experience, but we'll sort that out. Now, $28.07 all up, even though we're missing the chips. That was for the palmy box, the drink large chips and onion rings. onion rings so my guy was 18.99 and it does actually say on here i should have just looked at this small chips so there you go folks small chips in the box you love not to see it i'm not loving it now with all that being said you know me guys we've got our potato and gravy now this should be interesting because we've tried all the other types let's see how this hits or potato and gravy. So I might have dunk an onion ring in, in that later. Now guys, fear not if you're worried that Liz hasn't got much food here, which, you know, that is a decent sized mm. chips. I'm not going to take it off her because we're going to do another thing later after this on our adventures on the way back. And she'll get a, a good feed, won't you? Mm -hmm. Let's try this. Wow, that actually is pretty good. 
I actually like that. It tastes like a bit of a roast chicken sort of taste. Oh. Which is amazing. These are really crunchy and good. Are they? Mm. I could eat that. I could scoff a lot of that just on its own. But. Should have got a large. With that being said. There's a chicken leg piece. Oh, I thought it looked a bit scabby. And it does really a little bit. Don't you think? Crunch fried chicken. Yes, I do Crunch think. fried chicken. But. It's sort of in between these days, I guess. It's not too shrimpy. I need the extra salt. Go for your extra salt. There it is. Big hit of potato and gravy on the chicken. Oh, I should I should have poured those crumbs on the chips. Ugh. I'll do that. Why not? I love those onion rings. They were good. Cool. I would get them again. So... That with the potato and gravy, of course, mostly all I can taste is potato and gravy. But I'm gonna have a hit of it on its own with no potato and gravy. If you can hear that little oh, eh, I've eh, been feeding noise. I've been feeding magpies as a baby. As a baby magpie. So let's try this and see how it hits on its own. I'm getting a bit of spice from that. I don't know if it's from the gravy or not. Oh, and I'm pretty sure, correct me if I'm wrong if you know those of you who do know I'm pretty sure that's a southern fried chicken or their chicken like that on the bone doesn't taste too overpowering they ain't too bad chips are nice because they're soggy actually because I don't have any chips mm, try them. I want to get a big one <laughs> or a couple geez you're really hoeing into them Anyway, I'll try a chip. I want to try it with potato and gravy. And actually, I did have that first one that was in the bag. You've killed it with salt, but it did actually have a, quite nice. a nice... Um, it was nice without the salt, whatever they put on it. Chicken salt, whatever it is. Could you taste that on its own? No. You just put it on straight away. The salt. I don't even try, I just salt. Okay. Well, let's see what the onion ring's like. That probably has that... Um, the onion rings are good. That probably has that seasoning as well. It did, yeah. Whatever it is. Nice combo with the gravy, potato and gravy and that. Well, let's try it on its own. Did you put salt on them? Yep. You stuffed the whole bloody thing up for me. You weren't <laughs> supposed to be eating them anyway. I know, but you gave me one in the box. But what I will say is, even though you put salt on it as well, I can taste the, the coating. It's like the chips without the extra salt mm. and whatnot let's get into the old palmy burger i won't say palmy or palmer because we know what will happen there there it is folks all right so this should have a piece of chicken which i'm assuming is just like a chicken patty not a proper piece of chicken there we go got some bacon bit scabby there on the bacon not sure what this one would cost on its own because you can just buy the burger we got the old sauce of course what are they? It's got something on there. I don't know what that is. I might try one on its own. I think that were those ball mm. things I saw on the menu. Oh, that's right, because it's supposed to have cheese, and it's got some cheese there, but that tastes like something cheesy. You know what, folks? I'll see if I can find it on that menu thing. But time to tuck in the good old palmy burger. <sighs> can Just I have a drink? Go for it. It's this. to share. It's a hot one here today. It sure is, it's a stinker. So we're sort of winging it a bit here. We didn't do too much investigations. I sort of knew this was what I was going to get, even though there's plenty to choose from. You, of course, were going to get chips. You knew that. So you're happy with the chips? Mm. Good. Do you reckon they're West Western Australians fire the finest? <laughs> I do. Well, I don't like any of the other big chain chips, so they're my favourite. I'll tell you what, total super sprinter. What? you got thongs on, you almost got this dripped on you. Oh god. Can't say I'm mad about that sauce. What flavour is that? That I don't know. Mm. Oh, that parmigiana stuff. Oh yeah, that's right. Well, how Aussie is that if I don't know that? It's a palmy burger. Uh -huh. It's like a Napoli or whatever sauce, Parmigiana sauce, tomato. Not a not a big fan. And it's just like swamped in it. It's pretty much all you can taste. Mm. 
So of course folks, out in the elements we've got to deal with planes and whatnot and all sorts, so that's your palmy burger. I'm going to finish up here, this has been a total mess, hmm. bit of a disappointment actually and you know what, the whole day just getting here and everything has gone a bit like that hasn't it? But what can you do, you have days like that. I ain't complaining too much, but it was worth a try, worth a crack, so not sure if we'll be back again. Do you reckon you go back again? Only when I'm in Perth, because I'll get some chips. <laughs> get some Not chip. here. And they have sweet potato too, don't they? Yeah, they like were them. really good. You tried them in Perth, yeah. I did. So, considering how far I have to go to get this again and to show you guys, it may not ever happen again, but we'll see what happens. I'm going to give this $18.99. If I had the chips, of course, we're going to go back and get them, apparently. We are. We are. Misses onto it. Yeah. Um, she'll get them for us. With the chips and everything, $18.99, I'll probably give it about a three and a half stars out of five for value. And for taste, it actually wasn't bad. I'll give it four and a quarter. So folks, the cicada's about winding up. We better vamoose. Anything you'd like to say before we go? Nah, just I highly recommend the onion rings on the chips though. Cool. Don't have to use as much salt as I did. They did have a good taste without it, but I'm just a salt kind of girl. I know. You I'm are. a salty girl. She's very salty in a good way so guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe not that one either it's very mm. parmesanery and don't forget to subscribe and remember you can never be too Aussie hooroo stay fresh that's my girl well folks she did what she said she's gonna do she got our tips and you know what uh, very hard to do this with one hand because I'm holding the camera we got another large you love to see it good on your chicken treat thanks you've made up for your, your big mistake well little mistake really thanks love for going and getting them oh that's all right now i gotta have a chip and see what they taste like with this seasoning and they gave us a large i said that's oh sorry <laughs> do you mind holding that please i wasn't listening as that's usual right. too busy on your phone but that's cool what woman ever listens to a man gotta have a chip and cook fresh yes i had to wait but they were nice and fresh what do you think minus the salt i'll give them this much the chips are on point. I like it. I like that oh, seasoning. Yeah, me too. Totally, totally eats well. Let me try one without salt. Yes, give yeah. it a give it a crack. See what you think. Considering I'm the chip expert, not you. Oh, they're hot. Mm. Probably about the hottest chips we've ever oh, had yeah. from wow. from a place like this. Um, what do you reckon? They're good. Good stuff. Yeah. All right, guys, signing off. Sayonara. Good on your love. Thanks for getting them. All right. Stay fresh. <laughs>